All right, gang, what's up? You're back. We're back in the cyberpunks. Get this cool little relic. Let's go. And we need to wait two days for Solomon Reed's call. So in the meantime, what are we going to get up to? What am I going to do? All right, yeah. So in the meantime, I think what we're going to do is we're going to head down here to Terracognito and we're going to help out our little boxer friend that we spoke to the other day. What's up, guy? Just chilling on a balcony. Having fun. So let's get on over there. All right, so here we are. We got a little bar guest. What are these things called? I don't even really know. I guess they're just like... I mean, they're cargo things, but... Ah, right. Okay, so we figured it out. They're called AVs. <laughs> uh, I don't really know what that stands for. That's a cargo AV, though. That's gonna be it's a great big one. Anywho, we are here at Terra Cognita, so let's go see what... Oh, where's your place? Oh, here and there. Nice. Uh, we're gonna go up this... Uh... Do I have to call it down first? I do. Here we go. Got a nice little elevator here. Oh yeah, baby. We're going to Terra Cognita. What's up? Pretty big elevator. That looks nice. You think I kill people over there soon? Maybe. Maybe. So I'm pretty sure that's the building we were in with Myers at the start. Pretty sure. At least it looks about right. Anyway. Oh, got another walk. Hold on, this is cool. You got purple eyes. Oh no, you just got one of those things on you. Man. One day, that's gonna be the real fashion. For sure. You may say, ah, nah, we're not gonna dress like that. That'd be dumb. We've already made fun of it too many times. Mm-mm, it's coming, baby. Who doesn't want to wear a bunch of neon stuff on them once it's, like, just easy? It takes, like, almost no power to do it. can already kind of do it. you not to take that new Scott here to work. The hell do you mean you're on your way? Is he really trying to get her out of Dogtown right now? Bro, it's not gonna work. See, there's gonna be some bullshit that goes down. That does it. Come on. Oh, he's fast. Oh shit, he threw a grenade. Get out. Why do I have this thing? Oh, right, right, right. I almost forgot. I, uh, I equipped this so that the bar gas weapon, this, would have better, uh, penetration. It's, a uh, rate of fire is kind of doo-doo. I wasn't getting a whole lot. Maybe, I mean, it is... It seems like limited in the thing. Like you cock it and then you like have to wait a while before you can shoot it again when you're in uh Sandy. That felt that felt weird in the Sandy. That didn't feel like normal guns. Okay, hold on. We're gonna we're gonna fix this. We haven't been using the sword a whole lot, so we're gonna be jumping around with the sword a whole lot. And we're also Is this fully upgraded? It's not quite fully upgraded yet, but we're gonna get there. 
Yeah, we're pretty close. Um, we need to do something with this, uh, with this Chimera Core, yeah? So... Let's... First of all, finish upgrading this. Boom. Tier 5, 5, tier 5 plus plus. Uh, I do want to fully upgrade this and give it a shot as well. It just seems like a really, like a fun thing to just kind of dink people with. Well, we'll do that in a sec. First, does this, this has, does this have an upgrade slot? Because, see, a lot of the iconic weapons don't really have upgrade slots. And I think it, I think, I don't think it does. Or if it does. Yeah, it's just got a barrel. Um, hmm. So we've got... Firecracker, which makes you shoot explosives. Can you, are these like special mods? Can you attach these to things even if they don't have a mod slot, I wonder? I do have a good Achilles, so. This would be dummy. This would go dummy thick on my Achilles. I don't use smart weapons. Hmm. This is good. This is definitely good. But I also kind of already have something super broken. So I'm going to try to super tech out my... Uh... Where, where's that? Where's that? blind here we go yeah let's see what, what two do we have yeah that's good and then this is ah slot already filled okay so I would have to make another Achilles a new Achilles essentially and I can't put it on Iconic weapons. No. Okay, so. Hmm. That's fine. I can make another Achilles. Check it out. Bam. So this, in a way, gives me the ability to make this Achilles into an Iconic. The problem is... This Achilles is 5++, plus plus because I just found it. And this one's I can only make it 5, and you're not even allowed to upgrade non-iconics anymore. But I can unequip the thing here, because this is, like, special, so I could just... I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, I could throw something else on. I do like head toll. And see-through's fine. Hmm, 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 hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna go with see through because I mostly use it to shoot through walls and I want it to shoot through walls pretty well. Let's see what we can do with that. Voodoo boys working with Colonel Hansen. Skill shards, nice. They killed the homie though, who was in here. R.I.P. I actually didn't turn the radio on. Hold on. Okay. I've changed the radio binding because I, I happen to hit Z a lot. Because it's like a button you press in menus. And then we turn the volume down. I had the volume all the way up because... Like mostly for the car. But I think, you know what? We're going to leave it on. We're just going to kind of have some music here. Alright, now we're going to test some... Uh, something on these boys. Hmm. Oh. It seems all right. Who texted me? Yo, what up?
You see, I would have to... I'd have to, like, side-by-side -side them. To see if it... If it really matters. Because I, I lose a lot of damage. Just in general. But... Like, the extra charge capacity is also crazy. Ideally, I find a tier 5-5... Five five, a tier 5 plus plus. And it's just well charged, but, uh... Let's, uh, let's go meet Aaron. Oh, wait, hold on. I see some guys on the map. We'll test it. Okay, hold on. First, we found some guys, so... This is the Achilles on one, this is the Achilles on two, so on one. <laughs> About half his health bar in one shot. Uh, we'll finish them off and then find somebody new. Hold on, I'm bad. Missing. Come on. Stop, stop me. Hmm. Hold on, we're gonna we're gonna just kill these guys with just the one straight up. Guy, it does a lot of damage because eh, I don't know. <laughs> I mean on the one hand, we do straight up more damage, and then on the other hand, we increase the charge capacity, so we do more damage to the charge capacity. Uh, of course, obviously, we're just going to look for a tier 5 plus plus, but, um, yeah, at least the mods are movable, so that's pretty cool. We'll run around with it for a bit, see what we can do, but, uh, actually, no, we're not. We're going to go, we're not going to run around with it for a bit. We are going... We're going sword and with my new knives, because now my blue fang is 5++. plus plus. So, 100% chance to cause bleed. Or rather, what is this? What is this? Okay, so you, you throw the blue fang at somebody, and you have a really high chance to hit him with a poison. And you stun them, and then you get a guarantee, so they're stunned, so you get an easy shot with the stinger, and the stinger does this thing where it definitely poisons them if they're bleeding, and then I have something in, ooh, uh, isn't it cool? We gotta find it, hold on, here. Yeah, here. Thrown weapons against poison enemies instantly deal all the poison damage up front. Right, so that's how I'm gonna like two shot heavies with the throwing knives, especially with the with the uh with the crit dash. And this thing just looks cool as hell. Although the stinger does have a much better return, so you really do need to hit the heady. Because, uh, I get the return automatically if I hit the heading. So. Yeah, this was where we were at the intro. Anyway, um, okay, now that we're done bullshitting about builds and whatnot, <laughs> a, 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 a drop has come. So we are going to go get the drop and we're going to test out the new knife. Ow, don't do that to me. Okay, so... I didn't even hit the heady, but it like full killed him because it popped all the uh, all the damage up front. Even though he was a heavy, it just like insta killed him. That was pretty easy. All 
Alright, let's clean these guys up and let's uh, check what we got. Alright, airdrop time. The jack-in is very odd on these things. Here we go. If you get too close, it won't prank. Okay. BDBD1C55. BDBD1C. Yeah, here we go. Come on. Okay, cool. I don't really use those kinds of things. I mean, I don't usually use these either. Not bad, though. Crit chance for ricochet. I don't really use ricochet builds. They're not bad, though. That's just, like, kind of stuff I can sell. Or <laughs> probably just gonna, you know, disassemble it for the, uh... For the, for the, for the stuff. Oh, if you didn't know... Um... It is a bar gas build. Um, here we go. You go into... Where is it? If you go into backpack and you look at your weapons through the backpack, and you see over here when you disassemble something, it shows you over here. It'll tell you how many components you get. So a regular tier five will give you only five, but a five plus plus is going to give you fifteen. You get an extra five disassemble for every uh, for every tier plus it is over five. So you you actually get a whole lot from. Uh, from these tier five plus plus weapons you find, so these are these are good things to find. If you're even if you're not going to use them, it's a good thing because these crafting materials are valuable. I'm probably not going to use this. <laughs> it was a bit of fun, but yeah, cool, 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 cool. Okay, so now we're going to actually meet Aaron. See you when we're there. V. All right, here we go, man of the hour. It's good to see you. This way. Terra Cognita. Impressive. As I see it. Mm. City center post. <laughs> well, okay. Apocalypse or Pacificon steroids. She got the flowers. Lol. Dogtown's vibrant. Judy best girl. With Terra Cognita as its crown fucking jewel. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mass driver. Must really like the place. That's a rather large mass driver, it looks like. Wouldn't want to get hit by that. When that all went bust, we moved outside the wall. Back inside about a year ago. When I left the gang. Big building there. The men's clinics around the back. Hold up. One other thing I need to say. I'm, I'm, I'm going to tell you right now. I'm going to kill everybody. I hope you know this. No witnesses. Beeps like you. Always more to your stories. Never fails. <sighs> Truth is... Animals fix my fights. Angie, Animals Alpha, she decide which round I go down in. Chip in my head lets her do that. Fuck. Inner ear disruptor. Flip the switch, I flop over like a fish stood on his tail. So, afraid of other rippers botching the job. Want the chip removed by the guy who installed it. Yeah. They want it done today, too. Wanted to be a boxer. They turned me into a punchline. I take a dive now. Nobody will want to get me another fight. It's my last chance. Let's make sure it's not wasted then. Okay, well, that's fine. He didn't ask me to pull no punches. He he he. Where are you going, bro? Come on. Oh, cool. Scav got tons of bodies guarding the place. Any idea how we get in to see the men? I kill them, that's Not how. Yet, but I'll figure something out. That was almost bad. I almost wish Dash wasn't on double press. Is there a way to setting that? Leave it leave it in the comments below if you know. 
Oh, we're gonna go around the side. Oh, sick. There's a thing up there. Yo! How'd you get up here? Ooh. What's that? Cool. Oh, he got, he got jumper legs. Woohoo! Okay, check this out. Not that. Ah, it works all the same. Fuck it. All right, everybody, time to die. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Pull the finisher. Deactivate your sandy while you do the finisher. Then come back in here. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Can we jump up there? Oh, we missed it. Come on. Don't shoot me. That heart. Dude, come on, grab the ledge. Okay, Nito. What are you talking about? Stuck. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was not a good engagement. We survived though. <laughs> Took a couple down. That turret is a problem. Try to properly hit a dash this time. Also, we're gonna use. Hold on, come here. We're gonna use this to make get that quick disengage on these people. Shit, come here. Ah, I can't hit it. Hold on, I'm sorry. No, why did it throw the thing at the thing? That's what I wanted. Okay. Are they above me or below me? Together. 
Nah, I hit a foot. That guy just fell through the map! Is he coming down this way? What's going on? Stop these fucking games! What games? Oh! Now! Oh my goodness, dude, the parkour is off today! Also, these guys keep like falling through the map, what the hell? Again, hit the, hit the little thing. Get the pixel. Uh, well, I stuck him, but okay, we gotta go up. I can't double jump it, so we have to risk a ladder. Where the fuck did he go? He went downstairs. Oh my god. Second heart. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, now you... What the fuck is going on? Go ahead, shoot me. Go ahead. <laughs> the Miss Clinic. Top floor. <laughs> Oh man, okay, hold on. I'm gonna loot goblin all these guys and we'll get back. Okay, so we fell on accident, but we found this thing. Get an elevator access card. So if you want to use that uh, this elevator right here, that's all you gotta do. Take me up. Come on. Now let's go talk to the guy. <laughs> Adam, the mayor. Been a while. You know why I'm here. I told you not to come, man. Ever. Yet you do. And, and with protection. Who the hell is this? Hold on. Wifey's texting. Big sorry. I don't know what I said to her. Uh, sometimes the texts in this game get really glitchy. The one time Did it had me, me like send the same thing like three times in a row despite them answering a different question that I wasn't asking every time, so I wonder if that was just another text glitch. Aaron expected trouble. Hired me to keep things, uh, trouble free. You don't get it. If Angie finds out, I'll end up in the bay. A hole in my face. Cement shoes on hands and feet. Demir, you're the best ripper in this part of Dogtown. Angie won't touch you. Just help me with the chip. Bro, please. just tell me where the bitch is. I'll put a hole in her myself. Ain't no problem. Oh. Fuck. God fucking damn it. <laughs> Fine. We do it quick. Chair, let's go. V. Listen. Need to be sure I'll wake up after this. Can you wait here? Please? Oh, yeah, sure. Finished. The blockade is inactive. Kid will wake up soon. 
chip's just inactive? You were gonna remove it. True, but... Chip's buried in the inner ear. You'd have to get invasive. Receptor muting safer, less risky. Chip's dead. Aaron will recover quickly. Good work, Demir. Ah, oh, fuck. Look, Angie, you know how it goes. They come in, guns, fists ready. Demir, but what was I to do? For now. We'll talk later. I'll kill the shit out of you, bitch. There he is. Our little Aaron. Wonder what he's dreaming about. Apparently used his brain for once. Didn't come alone. Get her, boys! Okay. Get tougher stuff. Enough there is no get her, boys. I am ungettable. Uh, you know, I just kind of started killing things. I didn't even really think about it. Uh, I was supposed to talk to her. Hold on. Should I reload and talk to her? <laughs> Our little Aaron. Wonder what he's dreaming about. Apparently used his brain for once. Didn't come alone. Hmm. So, we gonna have a problem? You want a problem? How'd you find us? Have us followed? We have people here. Matters not at all, though. Let's focus on what does. How fast you die if I click this E yeah. button? Got any idea who you're protecting? Former gang goon. About to make amends. Amends, huh? Far too late for Aaron to make any. Aaron was our heavy. Good at it, too. Busted debtor's legs, set house fires. It's who he is. But wild violence like that needs honing, nurturing. So we invested in implants, training. Aaron owes us. We just want him to pay off his debt. Need him to throw the Vince fight. That's it. And we'll be even. Fight of his life, it's supposed to be. And you want him to take a dive. Aaron's mixed it up a dozen times till now. Most of his fights were fixed. It's nothing unusual. What do you do? Just flip the switch, watch him flop? I mean, the blocker. Never used it. He always went down on his own, when we asked. It's worked out well for him. Good for you, too. Let it go. We'll make sure Aaron goes down. You'll net 10% of the winnings. One other way to resolve this. Aaron will take his sweet time coming too. Unless you want to end up like Sasquatch. Didn't think he could afford a merc in your league. I was wrong. Swung above his weight. But I advise you to consider what you're gonna tell him when he wakes up. Wait, I'm sorry, I can't let you leave. I need your uh I need your special weapon. Get her boys! Get her, boys! Okay, cool. Fair enough. What up, buddy? You lied to me! You wanna end up like her? Fuck me, Angie. What the hell happened? How you feeling? Better than these animals. Wanna tell me what happened here? Sure! Your chooms came by. We, uh, didn't quite see things eye to eye. Fucking Angie. Never was one to let you go. Not a problem anymore. Thanks to you. Angie told me a bit about your past. A little ripping's no way to solve all your problems. This ain't about your boxing career. Stakes are different, you get it? Yeah, I think. Guess I know what you mean. Thanks, V. Yeah, whatever. Fuck 
king? Fuck! What did you do? Get out. Now! The scavs will let you pass. I have this mess to clean up. The scavs will let me pass? Hey, you're right, they did. Okay, so... Okay, so don't worry about what I cut out there, because I essentially just murdered all the scavs that were inside for uh, crafting parts and money. Um, I'm not actually crazy like that, I promise, but... Uh-oh. Uh There's more. <laughs> I just, uh... I really... How do I put this? And, and there's there's video games out there where people like talk shit to you, and it's like, are you kidding me, guy? Like, do you did you just see what I just did? Um, and then they have some like dumb, uh, like cinematic where you lose a fight. That's like if you just let me pilot it, I'd have like pooped on him. And uh, in this game, it's not a whole lot of that. Somebody talks ass to you, you put them down. You can just do it. What are they going to do? I think someone's there. Hmm. This isn't fun anymore. Wee! You know? So, I don't know. I'll, uh. I kind of want to do it again full talk mode. And just, like, kind of being the keyword. Kind of want to do it again full talk mode and just, like, see. Why can't I pick that up? What is that angle? What is that dead angle? Very interesting. What kind of stuff you can do? I mean, well, because the only other way to resolve it is to... He gets down in the fight. And what do you mean I really want to stay at your house? Get out of here. Oh, we get to hang out again. Okay, uh, I have to go meet Judy after I collect this airdrop. What up, guys? Aw, oh, buddy, you don't want to do that. Trust. Come out and play, you little cunt. Okay. Almost close there, but everybody's dead. The uh, the heavy killing with the double knife throw works pretty well. Uh, this one guy didn't die immediately from it, and I almost uh, didn't catch on to that <laughs> right away. Uh, but I'm going to clean these guys up and open the thing. I'll meet you back. All right. All right, here we go. Break in. Looks like it's already been broken into. What? Uh, I don't do, uh, I don't do hacking much, unfortunately. I didn't have to, I didn't have to pop that, pop the, pop the top on that one. 
Okay, hold on. I'm gonna go meet Judy right quick. I'm probably not gonna show that. Sorry, boys. delivery all good no uh, delays shipped first leg by sea then by air civilian craft both but it got to its destination fast and undamaged any developments here my status no real changes i suppose then it's time we got down to work gotta find our missing friend add another pair of eyes alex former team member she's in dogtown under deep cover. She'll help out. Adding another cook to the kitchen. Pretty crowded already. I trust Alex. Longshore stacks, the dive bar called the Moth. After sundown, yeah? Got it. And senses trained on any potential shadows. Okay. So we're supposed to go to this Moth bar thing. To meet another contact of Solomon Reed's. Here's Elba. But there is a gig that's on the way. This bit is getting kind of long. So I think I'm going to hit the gig because it should be shorter than any main mission. And then we're going to end the episode off waiting to go inside to the moth bar. Hers. V. A few days ago, scavengers hit a transport. The tech vanished, as did the guards. The latter will presume for good. Now, that would just be another day in Dogtown. Until I receive word from Zeta Tech CEO. The transport, though unmarked, happened to be theirs. Among the plethora of tech stolen, there was one precious eye implant and its schematics. The poor scavs seem unaware of its built-in GPS tracker. You'll follow their sick. Go to the scavs' nest in the scraper in the longshore stacks. I've sent you more details in writing. All right, no optionals, which means the gloves are off, baby. Bye. Intel didn't lie. This gear, what do you think it will pull back and stay? I just hope we get edgy. If Gitatech finds out we got drop on their transport, so bad that they do, huh? I can eat shit back in Night City. Oh shit, didn't mean to drop. Just get in there right quick. Nobody needs to be spotting any of this. Head back up.
See me out of the corner of your eye, but not, 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 the, not her. Who was like, I was like, oh, I was like, definitely in her peripheral. I'm like, can we walk along this? Oh, I can. Cool. Do -do 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 -do, don't pay any attention to me. Just gonna turn your cam off right quick. Hmm. Okay. I don't see anybody who can see these two, so we're gonna do this. We're gonna dash, dash to get the crit. And down they go. You did not die! Okay, now you're dead. I guess he was a heavy. Oh, but see, it worked. The, the, double, the double shot for the heavy worked. Don't worry about it. Okay, um, there's a cam down there. Again? Shit! Just override this right quick. Kill you so nobody can hack me. And we'll go up here and let the turds do some work. Usually they kill the turrets, but that turret is still standing. He's goaded. See, that is the power of uh, of thing. Uh, what's it? Tech, high tech, high tech ability. Anyway, there's people inside I need to kill, but uh, I'm gonna loot this up and then uh, I think they're probably just gonna still be in there. Oh, Wait, yeah, I don't have a whole lot to loot. Hold on, you can you can stick around for this. You can just watch the loot goblin do his work. Oh no, they've lost me. They've lost my view. Guys, come on. You gotta stay focused, alright? You gotta... Hey, look at this. There's stuff down here we can do. Oh, it was... <laughs> nice. Not only did they unmark me, but they turn their backs away from the entrance for a little bit. That's pretty crazy. Don't worry about it. It's the official... <laughs> official messaging. Okay. Well, there you go. That's those guys. Um, what's in here first? A code? What? I am no hacker man, so I cannot hack the door. Uh, here, let's just try boobs. No, 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 no.
Nothing. Okay. Let's go downstairs. Look at the pretty view. Oh shit. That's not good. Fuck. Oh shit, the, the finisher hit them both. Got a hitbox on it. I didn't really know that. I fell. Jump. No, don't grapple. Oh my god! Hey, we popped the fury. Whee! Okay, that was very messy. But we managed it. <laughs> you, over here. <laughs> Was that you shooting up the place? I almost feel sorry for them. Almost. Fancy eye. Let me guess. Zeta the Kyer. I think I know why you're here. Let me guess right back. Want me to rescue you? No, no. The prototype. And its schematics. Correct? They might have locked me up, but I kept the signal pinging from my prototype. I knew the corp would send someone eventually. Mm-hmm. Cute. Now the short version. Who are you? Hassan Demir, Zeta Tech Engineer. Only survivor of the scav ambush. Even for scavs, jumping in Corpo Convoy's next level gonkery. Something's off here. It was an undercover operation. Minimal security, maximum secrecy. So the scavs randomly ambushed you? No, no way. Someone rat you out, sell the product, sell out the client. Look, I don't fucking know. We'll cross that bridge later. Can you just get me out of here? Fixer didn't mention a rescue op. Only the prototype. You got it? Oh, I have it. Wait, wait, wait. Telling me you planted that tech in your own damn skull? Well, I figured it was the safest way. The border control scans don't recognize unreleased tech. 
In retrospect, it does seem uh, rather foolish. Then again, it bought me a few hours of life. We're a package deal, the prototype and I. You won't get it while I'm here, withering away. More luck than sense, this one. How gog you gotta be to chip yourself with prototype tech. No offense, V. I'm taken. Of course, unless Zeta Tech forced him into it. Made a guinea pig out of him. Prototech's capricious. Erratic. For a Zeta Tech engineer. Sure took a big gamble planting that thing. Indeed, a gamble. Yet the alternative was far more dangerous. Right. And Big Daddy Zeta Tech, all cool with letting some Dogtown Ripper fuck around with Papa's priceless prototech. Papa was not informed of the decision. Now, can we please take this conversation outside? Why all the drama over some measly implant? Some implant? Measly? Please, this design is a potential Kiroshi buster. <clears throat> We at the firm learned some Santo Domingo riffraff stole it from Arasaka Industrial Park. Naturally, we investigated. I was to conclude the sale at the stadium. Hush hush, not so much as a beep on Arasaka's radar. And well, here I am. Not here to... Look, if you want the implant, you need to take me to a ripper. Prototype's all I need. That still leaves the schematics. So that's your scheme, huh? There is a time... Yeah. Bypass the security. If you can't, the guard room's nearby. Right. Back in a nanosec. Ah, okay. I have to find the passcode. Maybe that'll get me into the other door. Anyway, I'm gonna go loot all those guys and meet you back here. Okay, we're back. Code is... 2573? 2753? Well, I see Zeta Tech spared no expense in hiring a real professional. Now your time to shine. How do you know where these schema docs are at? Their workshop. The scavs took me there, forced me to remove the security protocols on the tech they'd swiped. Uh huh. Lead the way then. And no gonk moves. Ha. <laughs> I leveled an entire scab haunt, bro. You would be stupid to try anything. I got prototype Sandy's in. Jesus, is that Harry? The man was a real prick, but this, it's barbaric. I suppose this would have been my fiery grave if you hadn't shown up. Burned at Zeta Tech. Nearly burned here. Ah. Everybody's just a little bit dead. Oh, I didn't make it in here. Ooh, a cool Sandy. Actually, it looks like it's kind of late, but hey. All this then. Right, right. This is it. It's got to be here. Somewhere. Found it! Prem, got it. Stick close. <laughs> we'll get you out of here. Wait. I heard you slaughtering them, which means so did half of Longshore. This place is about to be swarming with scavs. <laughs> you got an idea? Let's hear I it. I kill them all. Again. <laughs> I've seen the scavs use it. I suppose it's their emergency exit from the scraper. We'll vanish before they realize. Little to no risk. See? Not as burdensome as you thought I was. But I wanted to kill them. Okay, fine. It's time we were on our way. We'll do it the... Uh... Hold on, what's over here first? This is just some alternate way around. Okay, cool, whatever, fine. Wow. What 
lying about being yeah. <laughs> Bro was getting shocked <laughs> by it. As long as it's uh. <laughs> Should be safe here. Ah, I owe you one, truly. It was getting quite ugly back there. Yeah, but it was, mate. Sure thing. Not like I'm leaving empty-handed, right? Well, uh, I suppose I can take it from here. I'll tell my superiors you did one hell of a job. Oh, no, no, no. You'll sit tight while I call my fixer, grab some transport. Sure he'll want to handle the prototype personally. No, no, wait. I, uh, I can't go back to Zeta Tech. You know what? Getting on my nerves, Chum. You get one answer. What the fuck's your deal? And my deal, uh, uh, I don't intend to return to Zeta Tech. I plan to grab the prototype and vanish into Dogtown. I had a buyer. I was waiting on the signal to run. Then the scavs attacked and everything went to shit. Going back, it... It would be a death sentence. How'd you imagine playing a Megacorp? Must have had some kind of plan? I did, though I couldn't do it all on my own. I arranged a buyer at Dogtown Stadium. We would have met, were it not for these savages. Buyer could have hazed you, though. True. So I had the prototype implanted. It became my bargaining chip. He knew he couldn't harm me without jeopardizing the tech. I was to vanish during the convoy's inspection at the border. I arranged an unmarked car, bribed the guards, but then the ambush, well. Why are you so hell-bent on clapping this tech? Do you even have the faintest idea how much it's worth? Uh, when your life, right? Ah, I have no family, no friends. I gave my life to the corporation. The sacrifices I made. And for what? What life? The bastards stole it. The money from the prototype would have afforded me a fresh start. Gotta respect it. Wait. How in the hell did you think that was gonna go? I tell my fixer, sorry, shit out of luck, prototype bounced. Just say it got lost, moved, I don't know. I cut the signal. Your fixer can have the schematics. They're just as valuable. You can even fuck. Should have schemed a little harder before you squirmed into a Sakazeta scavenger shit witch. I fucked up, okay? If I'd known. Please, if you send me back, I'm dead. Newsflash, Chum. Dead already. They'll find you and snuff you before you walk with that tech. Then, I give up. Kill me. I'm not being dramatic. I'd rather die by your hand than their tortures. What? Okay. You and me never met. Our story, Scav's got the schematics, prototype win a wall. We clear. You, really? Yes, understood. I, thank you. Now I Delta. You, find a big ass rock, crawl under it. I mean it, Hassan. Zeta Tech gets a half a whiff. You dead. Right. Okay. Sly bastard bamboozled the corp and you in the process. Do nothing for Hassan. But I got a feeling his luck ain't gonna last. Yeah, but I like the sly bastard, huh? How about that? Generators! Okay, okay. Uh, I did a bunch of stuff with a bunch of vendors and whatnot around here, but we're gonna deposit the shard. I'm gonna give Mr. Hands a call. V, a little birdie chirp that you retrieved Zeta Tech's paraphernalia. Any issues? Birdie didn't say. Prototype wasn't around. Got the schematics, though. Got an issue? It's certainly a snag. Zeta Tech will not be thrilled, but I suppose that's my cross to bear. Transferring your compensation now. All right. I imagine I made significantly less off of that by not just murking the guy, but ah, he seemed cool. Come on, he just wanted out, man. You know what it means to try and get out. All right, so here we are. 
at hold on, come on. <laughs> the moth. Sick. So, uh, by the way, this is a cool little, uh, little place here. Neato. So we'll end it. I will see you all next time. Drop a like. Subscribe. <laughs> I have like two hours of recording here. There's a good amount that's going to be left on the cutting floor because we walked around a bit more. But even still, hope I didn't go too long. <laughs> uh, I'll catch y'all in the next video. See ya.